Yes, I'm back. <laughs> Another one. You know where I am going. You know which road I am traveling. Mm -hmm. I am being roasted. I am roasting others also. And this time it's my own prime minister's wife. As a matter of fact, both of them. <laughs> yes, they held a party conference on Sunday. Mm -hmm. All green. The whole nation. Then the people who are support that particular party, everybody turn out in a them green. Man, you would believe that you were in a forest that was enjoying good, 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 good springtime. Mm -hmm. Green. Luxurious green was the color of the day. Mm -hmm. Sunday. Sunday gone. Yeah, man. The people then turn out. From green eyelashes to green eyebrow to green teeth to green hair to green necklaces, green green clothes, everything green. Yeah, man, them come out in a them numbers. When we have party conferences here in Jamaica, you know, you know, political conferences, people turn up to support them party. And Sunday, last Sunday, was the JLPs, the Jamaica Labour Parties annual conference people from all over the island and maybe overseas to travel into kingston for that party hey <laughs> oh son of blaze son hot prime ministers wait yeah man what a run off and feet i think is a stream you know maybe don't river falls and that's what the water running us it's a run uh -uh. Man of him want a crutch in a pocket, you know. Hey, him wife, your man one member of parliament too. She just get roasted down in Miami. Couple, what, two weeks ago? Mm hmm Them bore and keep up all kind of charade with she. So she did the conference, yes. She's a member of the political team in the country. Mm hmm Representing the same party as her husband. Hey. You don't think there's a serious meeting at one, you know. Mm hmm But then them turn it out in a one puppet show. As though people are wedding or something. Now the Prime Minister hop down him a talk and him a sweat. Have him own a kerchief in her pocket. Eh eh. Prime Minister wife, she jump up a long time in a she green clothes. Hop in her face. Her mm -mm. wife sweat as though it was a wedding ceremony. And she was some, I don't even know. Because I would have any groomsman or whoever, I'll do the wiping. Hey! But she was now the maid of honor for the Prime Minister of Jamaica. Mm -hmm. She had wiped sweat, and if that wasn't all, hey, hey. big chops. Mm -hmm. In the middle at the conference, big. Mm -hmm. No, you tell me. Wasn't that really disrespectful and distasteful? No, at that point in time, this man was not your husband. At that point in time, this man was in the capacity of the prime minister of this beautiful country. And you, Ganga, Aboskis, hmm? at that time, you were just another citizen of this country. Mm -hmm. Just like me. Or just like any other parliamentarian. I wonder if Miss um, Currency and Morrison had gone up to wipe sweat and to chops in the Prime Minister. If that would have been taken in the same light. Mrs. Holness, you did out a place at that point in time. At that time, you were not expected to be doing that. No. At that point in time, you were no wife of the Prime Minister. You were a representative of the party, representing the people in a, your constituency. You both your gonna wipe sweat and a mwah. And when you hear about you so insecure that you come at a big, big political meeting, come on, mwah. For what? Is who no know say you named Juliet Olness, wife of the Prime Minister of Jamaica, and member of parliament for some place? Hmm? Who no know say you see what did go down in Miramar County two weeks ago and get boo 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 and you come back here for the same boo you're not tired to get boo oh man understand yourself yeah man may I call you out 
that was not necessary. That was not necessary, and it not taste good, it not feel good. And you know the worst part of it? You did have on lipstick, and God put it on him on lip. Wrong place, baby. The exchange of lipstick is not on the public stage. If you're in the habit of exchanging lipstick or putting on your lipstick on your husband, at that point in time, he was not your husband. Hmm? Ended up that in pregnancy, they had to wipe off the lipstick, you know, and show us. Because, let me tell you, you know, hey, enough <laughs> bashing she gets for that, you know. Because, let me tell you, the other vloggers are not nice when they are drag out people and roast them, you know. Because, now for them estimation, the Prime Minister wipe off the kiss. Mm hmm Him show her no love at that point in time as a wife. Him wipe it off. But me, a next woman, me now agree saying did I wipe off no kiss. No, a lipstick. When she did left pan him mouth. I that me not wipe off. Mrs. Juliet Olness, wife of the Prime Minister. Understand yourself, no man. Me I wonder me after already if one next female. Member of Parliament for your own constituency it did go up and see the need to wipe sweat after the prime of the prime minister's face, yes, and then mwah, I chopped the prime minister. Would you have been offended? Hmm? No, you shouldn't be because at the time when you do that gross disrespect to us who were there, to us who were watching, to us who have to watch the replay. And the many clips that are circulating. That was gross disrespect. You don't jump up in a public and kiss up husband. That's not part of it thing. Or what you are trying to say to us there. Oh, we are in love. I love my husband. He was not your husband at that time. Stop it. He was not your husband at that time. He was in the capacity of the Prime Minister of Jamaica. He was representing the country at the highest level. Mm -hmm. He was there addressing his party supporters and the nation as a whole. And you can bring. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Huh? Leave that for someplace else. Leave that. Where you go with that? But yeah, mwah. I mean, it was such a fast. Mwah. It's like, are we not trying to prove lady love? Hmm? You know, say, not some cultures, you'd have been imprisoned for things like that. Yes, to show up any type of affection in public, to be kissing in public, you would have been charged. Mm -hmm. That would have been an offense, a punishable offense. So, love, don't do it again. It is distasteful. And I know all of us, enjoy seeing that because that are but to behavior people who are insecure people who don't know the role of the office that they must serve people who don't know how to behave to represent the office where they may represent hmm? but you gonna mwah, 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 prime minister eh? you should have been charged i hope i hope that our beloved Prime Minister. Mm -hmm. I have to say that though we roast him and we roast him and we roast him, he is still our Prime Minister and must be respected as such. Whether or not I agree with his policies for the country or the way the country is going, truth is, I we elect him. And whatever and be short at this point in time, mm -hmm, we will grin and bear it little until next time. Mm -hmm. Where you going about your mwah? Not do it again. Do not do it again. Do not do it again. As a matter of fact, I don't think you ever do it again. You're supposed to have learned your lesson well. <laughs> uh, let Oness, MP. No love lost. Mm -mm. But I have to roast you. Alright? I'm June.